Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Damaris and for today's video I will be showing you guys my lounge fly collection but new backpacks and new purses because my collection keeps growing um, almost every week actually. <laughs> so I have a couple of new bags and backpacks that I haven't shown in any videos. So um, if you guys want to see the quality of these purses and backpacks and the way they look like, please continue watching my video. Let's start off with a backpack. Um, I purchased this recently. This is the Alien Claw backpack. Um, it is a leather-like material. It is called the Toy Story Claw Mini Backpack. And it looks like this. It's actually very pretty. Honestly, this backpack, um, like for me, I feel like it's underrated because um, it's, for me personally, it didn't say much online on the pictures, but when I saw it in person, I really liked this one. I love the detail of the actual claw from the machines. I absolutely love that. Um, the zippers, it says Pizza Planet. And um, the, the material of this backpack is very sturdy, very nice, honestly. It has a pocket in the front. Let me try to open the pocket so you guys can see. Well, yeah, it has the... Uh, it still has everything intact. Let's see inside. Let's look at it inside. Well, let me show you guys like this and show you the back. It's a very sturdy backpack, to be honest, and I really like the material that they use for this. I wish they would use this kind of material for a lot of other backpacks because it's very, very, very pretty. Let me see. Yeah. So it's very starry, like a starry night. And because this is like see-through, you guys can actually see the lining of this. Woo! The glare. But yeah, you guys get it. It's a very pretty bag, honestly. So that's how this bag looks like. The Disney Pixar Lounge Fly logo. It's a very beautiful bag. Super underrated. And um, yeah. For my next bag that I'll show you, it's another cutie as well. It's my Hercules, baby Hercules with a Pegasus backpack. The details on this backpack are so pretty. Uh, the details on here. This backpack is velvet-like, like suede-like. So it is a little bit more um, on the um, uh, delicate side because anything can dirty this bag. So Honestly, when I saw it in person, I really liked this one too. This was another one that like when you see it in person is a lot cuter than um, than when it's not well than you know the pictures online. Um, it, it's so cute this picture. Every, again, everything in this backpack is suede like. Um, look what it says here. Too cute for the cosmos. Um, yeah, the back looks like this. It's a pretty back it's all like cloudy which i was expecting for um hercules so it says disney lounge fly logo um yeah it's a very very pretty bag again because of the material of this bag um i would be a lot more careful because you know it's it's very delicate and this is the lining for this backpack it's all clouds so yeah, it's a very pretty backpack. I, li I liked it a lot in person, um, more than in pictures. It looks very, very cute. I like this one. Um, I, if you are a person that, I, I'm not, I don't wanna say if you stain things, but if you are a person that you're gonna use this bag constantly, it is gonna wear and tear faster because of the material. But other than that, it's a very beautiful backpack. It's uh, truly adorable, actually. The size, everything, and the little details, like, go far and beyond for me. But, uh, yeah, it's very delicate. <laughs> Next backpack, let's go on to this big one. 
So this is, I don't know if this is considered a mini backpack because it ain't so mini. <laughs> but it is the material of the mini backpacks. It's not like the loose ones. So let me see actually, let me see the tag if it says it. It does, it is considered um, 101 Dalmatians mini backpack. So it is considered a mini backpack, but this one is huge. Um, I absolutely love and adore dogs. So this one was one that I wanted to have for my collection because obviously I love the movie 101 Dalmatians, but, um, but I also love dogs. So <laughs> uh, this one is an adorable one, super cute. Um, all the dogs are everywhere. Uh, this is how it looks in the back, which I really like the fact that they continued the dogs even in the back. Um, because the majority of backpacks, they have a different color in the back or a different something in the back or a plain back. But I re really like the fact that they continued it in the back as well. The, the whole dog concept. Um, this is how it looks in person. I love the little detail of the little Dalmatian on the keychain. I don't know if you guys, and the, not the keychain, on the zipper. I don't know if you guys notice it. It's a little Dalmatian there which I really love that little detail. The Disney Loungefly logo, uh, the metallic one obviously, and it's black, so I like that one too. And then my favorite part of this backpack is the lining, which, you know, it was expected, but, you know, it gave it a little extra touch, which is this, the little dots, polka dots everywhere, the dots, so because Dalmatians have dots everywhere. So it's very, very cute. And yeah, this backpack um, retails for $69.90. So yeah, this backpack retails for that. Um, if you're a dog lover, if you're a Dalmatians lover, um, you should definitely get this backpack because it's very, very pretty, huge, and so that's another thing I love, that you can fit water bottles, you can fit a lot of things in here. So when you go to the Disney park, or you go to any park actually, um, it's very um, worth it because it's so big that it fits so many things. So yeah, that's my Dalmatians backpack. Now let's move on to a different backpack. To have it even, I'm gonna do first the backpacks and then the purses. So my other backpack that I have, which is actually my last backpack to show you guys, uh, is this Figaro backpack, mini backpack. It is super, super cute. The material of this is uh, the leather-like material. This has cloth over here. This part is like cloth, but the rest is very leather-like. So this is how it looks like. Again, the, the logo of the Disney Loungefly is black, which I really like, and metal. And this is the back, which has a little tiny um, surprise. So it says, making a splash. I love that, that little detail because honestly, you won't, people won't see it because when you're wearing it, you can't see it. But the fact that you, the, per, the owner, sees it and knows that that's there is super cute, that little detail there. Um, yeah, this backpack is very mini, just like the other ones, um, but again, super, super adorable, um, and, you know, if you like Pinocchio, if you like Figaro, um, yeah, you definitely like this one. Let me see, let me show you guys the inside. Okay, so maybe I can show you the, the lining. Ooh. The lining is like that. It has little, um, paw prints. I like the fact that on this backpack, I like the way they did it, that it's black and white. So it's black and white leather. I really, really uh, like that, you know, detail on the back. And that was my last backpack. Now I'm gonna show you my purses. So this is my first purse that I own that is, not, is on the lower price range. Um, if you guys don't know this information, um, the on lounge fly backpacks, the ones that have the metal lounge fly sign or you know the, the logo um, are the ones that are high end backpacks, like the more expensive ones or purses, the more expensive ones. The ones that have leather stitching with the logo sign are the ones that are lower price backpacks or purses. So this is actually my first low 
pricing purse that I bought and um, it's actually really cute. I was really happy that I got it. This is the um, Sleeping Beauty purse. I bought it in Hot Topic actually. I got this purse in Hot Topic. Uh, it's very pretty. This is her castle and the three fairies. That's how it looks like. You turn it around and it looks like this and it says dreams do come true and this is what i'm talking about you see that the the logo the lounge fly disney logo it's leather and it's stitched in so because it's leather that means that this is on the lower um price range and yeah i honestly i don't I, I really don't care if it's lower price range or more expensive as long as I like the design for it and um, I actually thought that this backpack look like because I bought it online so online it looks a lot bigger I, I envisioned something to be like a very like almost like tote bag um, but this one actually it's it's a perfect size it's like a medium size it's not too big not too small um, you know, you can see the sizing compared to my face, like, and I don't have a big face, just saying. Um, but yeah, um, it's, it's not so big, it's not so small either, so it's a perfect size, honestly, and I didn't even take out the, <laughs> the plastic on it, but it's very pretty bag, but these on, these also, because they are on the low, I'm guessing, I'm not sure, but because they are on the lower price range, um they the lining is basic doesn't have anything no details it's just you know one color it does bring the straps it brings the straps so that you can make it a crossbody and yeah this is how it looks inside whoa maybe you guys can see them it looks like that it's filled with stuffing <laughs> and yeah this and i noticed also the 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 details of the difference between the stitch ones like for example the zippers the zippers are not like the other backpacks or purses that they say lounge fly this is a regular type of zipper so that that also those little details that you can tell that you know it's not on the high end or better quality backpacks but the material is still a good quality it's like the other backpacks that are like leather like material so it's a very sturdy bag but um yeah but it's it is on the lower end but it's still very pretty and very worth it to me <laughs> my last bag that i will show you guys is one that i got in the mail yesterday i was so excited to get it in the mail because um it's another princess one and if you guys don't know this or you already do i tried to collect princess bags um and princess funko so i like the princess part of the disney lounge fly um themed bags and um so they recently launched fly on their website they recently launched this bag and I needed to have it to my collection. But here is the most beautiful Pocahontas bag. This is how it looks like. Honestly, the colors are out of this world beautiful. Um, let me show you like this. It's it's like watching the movie in a bag. Like, um, and this is how um this one it is um the front part is kind of like leather like and then the sides is like suede and this is the back it's, it's very very pretty um and again it is kind of like leather and then on the sides is suede and then the compass <laughs> and you open it up and which i like the fact that when you open it up it's still the same picture like what what <laughs> It's the same picture and then this is suede like here and inside I have put the chain because it is a cross body bag I put the chain it is a cross body but let me put the chain back inside because I like the chain inside <laughs> to display it and then the lining inside 
it's all the leaves I, you guys can barely see it there but let me see if in this angle you can see it a little bit better yeah there it's all the leaves so it's like a blue lining with all the beautiful colored leaves that are all like pink and blue and purple so yeah it's a very very pretty bag it smells so good because i love the smell of like brand new purses and backpacks like the leather smell it's so good yeah so this backpack is um lounge fly actually this tag doesn't say the price i was trying to find the price for you guys but uh because i bought it straight from lounge fly's website i guess the tag um doesn't have a price um, but uh, it is $65, I believe, on the Lounge by website. So if you guys want to get it, go for it. <laughs> I love the, the Disney logo, the Disney Lounge by logo. Um, I love that pink. It's such a pretty pink. And yeah, I got this one. This is my last bag to show you guys. Not my last bag because I still have... I actually have three bags coming. So... And I have three more bags. So, you know, my collection still grows constantly. I'm a very obsessive person. So now that I'm collecting, I keep obsessing and looking and looking to find new bags. Um, also, I wanted to show you guys. This is not a bag, but I did get it in the mail already. Um, not in the mail. I'm sorry. I did buy it in my box lunch. Um, which I also have another order of it. Um, and they were supposed to... They said that the delivery for that... Like, I put to be delivered to my box lunch so I can pick it up in store and I still haven't received it in store but I went to the store and I saw that they had some so I ended up buying it and I haven't canceled my other order because I may want to anyways um, I got this coin purse the Cinderella coin purse it is leather it's a leather coin purse and it's like this it's super cute it says LF for launch buy on the zipper because it doesn't have the actual thing because it's so small I, I'm pretty sure like they were like we can't just put launch fly stuff on the thing so yeah <laughs> so this is how it looks like it's a tiny coin purse um yeah it's really cute it's uh, it says the retail price is $10.90 for this one and yeah it's a very cute the lining is simple it's just pink it doesn't have anything you know, nothing out of the ordinary. But yeah, it's for my Cinderella's uh, 70th anniversary collection to add it to my collection because I have the wallet, I have the purse, I have the backpack. I have pre-ordered the other pink backpack, so I needed to have the whole collection. So I got this too. <laughs> we have reached the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I wanted to show you guys the purses and the backpacks so you can get a little bit of more accurate information and see how the materials are and if you were, you know, trying to buy one of these or any of these items um, so you guys can see how it looks in person and um, if it's actually worth you buying it or not. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel to get to see every time I post a new video up. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys on my next video. Bye!